to show until Wednesday. Today I am showing my dolls where I am making them their shoes and I am in a work in progress. This right here is the newest one and they have been made for my size Barbie almost at 40 inches tall. What I did here, just for the sake of doing the video, I put the lace, I wrapped it around her, and I am here behind the scenes. I'm holding it with two pins. I first hold it with the pink one, and then with the pearl one, which is more visible from far away. And so that way she's not nude. In the meantime, that I will be making her clothes. But this right here is a commission. And if I have enough lace, the one that I have here on the side, I will be posting them available at my Kofi and my Mercari. And I am still working on the shoes, on the slippers. And the ones that I made for Chatty Kathy. And they also fit 18 inch dolls. So let me get my doll and put them on her. Here is my American Girl doll and she is wearing the dress that uh, Chatty Kathy was wearing. Here she is in the back, kind of shy because I took her clothes away. But here we have her wearing the same dress. Mary had a little lamb and she's also wearing the denim shoes. So how about that? Look how much taller Chatty Kathy is but they are sharing dolls. And in the background, I have the dolls in the background and I will go ahead and show you I will just move oh, her little tiara I just fell I'm gonna move Barbie to the side and I am not having luck with her tiara so let's do this again no it's not gonna work out she doesn't want it and this is how she gets her little hair step so I'm gonna move her to the side so that we can see what we have here so here we go so like I was saying in the back of the hutch I have the doll set up and I have a glass over here to hold it and there is a lever in the bottom that works perfectly so right over here from behind where my girls are, Chatty Kathy and American Girl doll. Over here in the back, I have this lovely doll. Uh, when I was looking for Skipper and I found her, and before that, I didn't even know who she was, but she's just adorable. I love dolls with freckles, and her name, I believe, is Fern. Oh no, Joy from Little Women. And it's from Mattel, the series of When I Read, I. I dream and she has the cutest little dress and this one I bought her out of the box so she can come with her shoes or maybe I took her shoes I borrowed them and here are my toner dolls I'm just gonna move ahead to the side here so we can have a better view over here I have the toner dolls a little Christmas scene in a very lovely metallic uh, sleigh that came from a gift of my daughter's. It was full of chocolate. I think it was Godiva. It's such a pretty little sleigh over here. Can't see it because they're kind of all together. And a little Kicket doll. And a porcelain skipper doll. I put her over here because it seems safe. And a porcelain little bunny and a skipper doll. And to the side, I'm going to move again, I have uh, Disney Animator dolls. I have two Cinderella's back to back, and I have the, it's a small world doll, little Hawaiian doll. I have her outfit, I need to put it back on her, and I have Snow White here, need to fix her hair. The little lamp which is on quite cute as my nightlight 
I have these saucy walkers, I believe. And this one's just so cute. I think they're adorable. I love their outfits. Very vintage of the 50s. And I'm going to move the phone here to the side so we can see this lovely redhead. She came like this and she has that uh, wig net or that net in her face. And further down in her little school outfit, this was a gift, this little desk from my daughter's fiance. And we have this mini American Girl doll. And I just have a lot of dolls over here stacked to the corner. So, so the corner is kind of messy, like a nice messy. And way in the back, you can see my plastic drawers. This is what I had. Well, I still have these because they're inside, but the ones that I used, this is what they look like. Uh, they have the drawers. They're, they're not broken. And it's a series of three. So those are the ones I've had since the year 2000. And the ones that I upcycled up and put my Halloween fabric in. So there, that we have. And I was kind of bending since, look, we're on the floor. So I was kind of bending there. That is my show and tell for today. Hopefully you liked my, my dolls and how I have them set up. Uh, please give me a like. And if you're not subscribed, please consider subscribing and a share, which is helping my channel grow. Uh, if you look at my playlist, you can see the variety of items I offer. It's from dolls to sewing to taking care of my pets and foster animals. And I mainly foster them when they need weaning, which means that they need to be fed every three to four hours or every two to three hours actually. And that is when there is no room at the rehab areas or because they need to be fed and there's, it takes a long time. So thank you for watching. We'll see you in the next video. Uh, go look at all the hashtags, um, show until Wednesday, and you'll be able to see um, more people putting up their videos or more channels, I should say, putting up their videos. Shout out to Tracy at Eclectic Wandering that started this hashtag. We'll see you the next week. Take care. Be safe. Bye. That's the ice cream. Can you hear him? <laughs>